Hey guys, so I just have a few words to say. Firstly, I'm doing well. Um, my knee did swell up pretty bad where I couldn't walk very well this past week, but it's getting better now. Um, that's not my point here. I want to just say some quick words. So I live in America and obviously things have been a little crazy. I'm sure you guys have seen the news and the videos and the tweets and all that wonderful stuff. I don't want to get political on here. That's not my, my point. One of his top priorities, our president, is to repeal the uh, Affordable Care Act. And I know it's not perfect. In America, we do not have a perfect health care system. And I think anyone can say and agree to that. There are a few things that it protects. It protects people with pre-existing conditions. It protects people with for lifetime caps. Um, it also helps people my age to be able to stay on their parents' insurance until they're 26. There are just so many things that go with it and certain things to help protect American citizens in regards to their health care. Being that I have a pre-existing condition, I am worried that I will not be able to get health care easily and it won't be as accessible for me or I will be denied uh, more affordable health care because I have lupus and because that is permanently with me and permanently marked down that I have this condition. Today I was actually checking my, I was trying to renew my mycophenolate, which is also called Celsept, and I noticed that the price is now $1,400 on it. Fourteen, $1,400. Now, of course, I have insurance, so for me it's only $25, and that's for about uh, 90 days of supply. Now, if I didn't have insurance, basically that's like a death sentence. Like, oh, you can't pay that much every month? Sorry. And that's not my only medication, that's the most ridiculous part. So here in the US, they can change the prices of drugs, um, you know, and like even hospital vi visits. They charge an absurd amount and it's just like, I know it doesn't cost that much. This pill should not cost $7 per pill. That's just ridiculous. They're taking advantage of the system. The big companies are just trying to reel in money. And that's what I'm really just over America being about money. And personally, I, I'm just, I'm a person that is for the people. I like to see policies that are gonna benefit the general public, not just a select few. And even if one day I'm making more money and I'm seen as maybe a higher class individual, which, I don't know, I'm just putting an example out there, I would still like to help and take care of people who don't have as much as me. And I, I just don't get it. I really don't get it. I don't want to get too crazy. I don't want people to, you know, hate me, but that's okay if you if you need to unsubscribe because of my viewpoints go ahead and all the things that are going on right now I think a lot of these things are wrong I think we need to start thinking about how we're treating people and how different policies affect people's lives and their families rather than thinking in our little bubble that we all live in and thinking that the policies that you want that are best for you are always going to suit you because later on in life something may happen to you or someone you love because of this policy that you once supported. This goes in regards to anything. Um, that's all I'm going to say. I'm going to keep it simple and this is kind of spur of the moment. I thought about doing a more uh, in-depth analysis of the Affordable Care Act, um, but I think I'm just going to do this quick video and, you know, who knows? We might not have it <laughs> in however much time. So. I'll just leave it at that and maybe make a video about it when something changes. And I really do hope that people have goodness in their hearts and, and I'm not saying that what it, when they take it away and put something else in place of it that they're not going to protect pre-existing conditions, but they haven't directly said that a lot of things that are being said um, haven't been promised. So it's kind of like I'm in the dark and I, I live in America and I'm worried about getting health insurance.
I never thought that would be a problem here. I'm also interested if you live in Canada or uh, anywhere in the UK, wherever you live, I'm, I'm interested to see how your healthcare works and um, the good and the bads, just to kind of get a more um, all around viewpoint of healthcare throughout the world. And yeah, okay. That's all I got to say. I definitely have all my workout stuff back there. That's cool. But I'll be making videos soon, more videos soon. Sorry I was sick and I just didn't have time to make any, um, didn't have the energy. All right, I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.